Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about the new Notepad app in Windows 11. Basically, Microsoft launched today the first version of a redesigned Notepad app for Windows 11. And in this video, we're gonna talk about it. We're gonna see what is new, if we have any new features, and you'll see that we have a very, very nice, very highly requested feature in the Notepad app. So before doing anything, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel if you enjoy these videos that I do about the these new Windows 11 updates and like that we are closing into 20k subs which is an incredible milestone. So let's begin with the video. First of all, what you need to know is that this new Notepad app is available on the dev channel. So if you are on the dev channel, you are enrolled in the dev channel of the Windows Insider program to install this new Notepad app. All you have to do is to open up the Microsoft Store, go into the library in the left side here and then click on get updates and you will receive updates for all the apps that will be receiving updates. Be aware that this is an update that is solely rolling to Windows Insiders in the dev channel, so not all insiders in the dev channel will have it right away. I'm really happy that I have it, so let me show you what is new in this new Notepad app. Let's open it first of all. As you can see, I think you all noticed something different about the app, the dark mode. Finally, Microsoft introduced the dark mode for the Notepad app. We requested this feature, I think, for over a year now, maybe a few years when Windows 10 first came up. And now we finally have this new Notepad app with dark mode and it looks really, really good. Of course, we have the new Windows 11 design. We have the rounded corners, the rounded buttons, and so on and so forth. We have the file button where you can open a new Notepad, a new window, open, save, save as, page setup, print and exit, basically the same settings that we had before. We have edit, which has a whole bunch of features and also a redesigned replace feature that we're going to talk about in a bit. And also view, we can zoom in, zoom out, restore default zoom, status bar and word wrap, which is basically a feature that we had before. And we have this button for settings. We can select the app theme. We have the system settings. So for example, if you have dark mode selected on your operating system, notepad will also get the dark mode, but the light mode looks something like this, but I won't ever switch back from the dark mode because I'm a huge fan of dark mode. And here in the font section, you can customize the font and you can see a preview down here, which is really, really good. Info about the app and also the button if you want to send feedback in the feedback hub. Let's type something in here. So for example, test Windows 11, new notepad app in Windows 11 and then tech based. So now let's go to edit and then click on replace. So as you can see here, we have the new replace menu. We have the option to find something and to replace something. Replace the first word found or replace all. Search down, search up. More options, which is match case and wrap around. And also if you want to exit out. And as you can see, we also have new animations and this looks really, really good in my opinion. I'm very happy that finally Microsoft got around this app and we designed it for Windows 11. Of course, they also worked on improving the performance with the language switching and so on and so forth. But what I find the most interesting thing about this app is that they finally added this dark mode and it actually looks really, really good. I cannot wait to use it more because I installed a third party app that had this dark theme. Now we will have the dark mode on the official notepad from Windows 11. I'm very, very happy about that. Let me know down below in the comments what you think about this. And also if I find a way to to install this notepad app on any Windows 11 version, even if you are on the main release, I will make a separate video about that. So as I've said, let me know down below in the comments what you think about this new notepad app from Windows 11. And also, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel if you enjoy these videos that I do about these new Windows 11 features. I was Emmanuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.